Open the prism and place the drill into the prism. The drill should protrude approximately 20 mm from the prism. Now adjust the cutting edge in such a way that it is positioned in between the two adjusting lines. Tighten the prism on the knurled screw. With that, the drill is properly adjusted. It doesn't have to be readjusted until the grinding process is finished. Then proceed to adjust the respective point and clearance angle on the machine. The point angle of a spiral drill bit usually ranges between 118 up to 130 degrees, so it can be seamlessly adjusted by opening the release handle. With deviating angles, you have the additional option to adjust the edge directly on the grinding wheel. The clearance angle may be selected, depending on the material to be drilled. By releasing the socket screw, the clearance angle can be set on the scale between 1 and 3. The normal range for a spiral drill is between 1 and 2. Now carefully insert the prism into the port and secure it with a clamping screw. Through cautious adjusting on the prism feet while pivoting at the same time, you will now finish grinding the first side of the drill. Mark the value you have reached as indicated on the scale and move back on the feet for reversing the prism. Now open the clamping screw and turn the prism by 180 degrees. In the next step, repeat the grinding process while following the value you marked before. As a result, you will have two symmetrically sharpened drill sites in exact geometry.